Hey, what's going on? So today I'm gonna to be replacing this bottom piece of trim here. This was already replaced once, as you can see it's been cut. And I pulled this off and spray foamed in behind it uh, so that I can let the spray foam dry and I'll cut that all off. And then I'm gonna patch in a new piece. But I'm actually gonna cut this up a little higher. Um, this has what looks like maybe like a 22 degree angle on it. I'm gonna cut a 45 degree angle. So I've already got it marked out here. I'm gonna bring you in and show you how I did this. So to mark this, I used my little square here and I made a mark like that. And then I used a speed square to make the 45 degree angle. Now all I have to do is use my multi-tool. Uh, I'll put a link for this down in the description. So if you're not familiar with what this is, uh, this is a Rockwell Sonic Rafter, but there's a bunch of different companies that make these. You can get them for about a hundred bucks that come with um, blades and everything and I'm gonna make that cut but it's really hard to make that cut so what I do here's a little trick I use my speed square to get the angle set perfectly to 45 degrees when I get it started so that I know that I'm gonna go straight in there and I try to follow that pencil line as I was going and then I will just work off of that angle towards the other direction And there we go. I just gotta get a pry bar to get this thing out. Yeah, no, I got it right here. And there we go. All right, so that's how easy it is to cut the bottom of a piece of trim off and you don't have to replace the whole board. Uh, obviously this is not optimal in all situations. Sometimes it's easier to just replace the whole board. This works really well if you have like, um, like a corner board on a house and it's only the bottom that's rotted. You don't want to replace a 16 foot board. You can just replace the bottom two feet or something or even cut it up like four feet. Uh, this technique works on a lot of different stuff. So just a good little trick to have. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel for more and I'll see you in the next video.